Back to the issue of police pursuits. Uh, they have been front and center ever since the law changed in 2021. It restricts officers from chasing suspects. They now have to have probable cause instead of reasonable suspicion that someone committed a crime in order to pursue them. Since then, the law enforcement community and some mayors across Washington state have been on a full campaign to reverse the law, saying the changes have emboldened criminals, especially when it comes to those stealing cars. Just last year, more than 45,000 cars were stolen. That's a big increase and police say it's directly related to the restrictions on police pursuits. So this year they were hoping lawmakers would come back to the table, have a discussion and tweak that law so it's more balanced in their eyes. But as far as one senator is concerned, not so fast. Senator Menka Dingra is the chair of the Law and Justice Committee. She is refusing to bring the bipartisan issue into her committee to even have a discussion. I talked to her just a short time ago. Take a listen. I know it's a bipartisan effort. Many lawmakers at least want to talk about it. You hold a lot of power right now. Uh, you chair the, you know, the committee there. Why not even bring it up for a discussion in your committee? Why, why not let it be on the table? So we do have a bill that's been dropped by Senator Lovick regarding um, high-speed chases. And to me, it always is about making sure you can articulate the problem you're trying to solve. And here we've had two competing interests, right? When we passed the bill, the, the interest or the problem we were trying to solve is the fact that 50% of the individuals that were being killed in high-speed chases were uh, innocent bystanders or passengers. That was the problem we were trying to solve. Senator Lovick's proposal doesn't address the reasonable suspicion versus, um, you know, probable cause issue. What would have to happen or tweaked in that proposal for you to at least hear the issues? Because if you come to the table, you can discuss maybe how to tweak it, how to make it better. But without you letting it come to committee, it's dead in the water. I'll just say a lot of these issues have, we've been having conversations about them for a year and a half. These conversations have been occurring. There's been a lot of engagement all across. The media has been covering it um, constantly. So these conversations are occurring on an everyday basis. There is no consensus on what that balance is. And this is where the legislature has to make that determination of that balancing act. And I will tell you that protecting innocent Washingtonians is always going to be a very high priority. So you heard Senator Dinga bring up Senator Lovick's proposal there. That is Senate Bill 5533. That bill, however, is only about bringing together a working group to discuss police pursuits. That bill will not address the crux of the issue, which is reasonable suspicion versus probable cause. Also, Senator Dinga continues to bring up those innocent Washingtonian lives taken due to police pursuits. So I asked her during the interview how many people were killed last year due to pursuits. She did not know that number right away, but her staff did follow up and sent me some data. They say before 2021's legislation went into effect, we had 11 people killed due to police pursuits in a span of a year and a half. Those 11 people are a mix of innocent bystanders as well as the suspects police were chasing. Now, they say after police were restricted in pursuing suspects, that number has dropped to three people killed. Of course, everyone would agree no one should ever die during any type of pursuit, but officers still want tweaks to the current law saying it needs to be more balanced so that they can go after criminals when necessary because then they say those people go and target countless other victims and all types of other crimes. Bottom line, they want to talk about it, but again, one person holds that key and she is not budging as of tonight. David?